2017 was a losing season for the Atlanta Braves, but it was a winning season for Cobb County. The new SunTrust Park brought lots of visitors and lots of money to the county. Today, the Cobb County Commissioners released a new report about the first year at SunTrust Park. Despite the concerns of critics and even some county officials, the numbers show the park is doing better than expected. Fox House Portia Bruner joins us now live with a closer look at that report. Portia? Yeah, commissioners telling me today that some of those concerns from critics and even some within the Cobb County leadership came because people just didn't really have a good sense of the numbers until just the last couple of weeks. That report being released today at the Cobb County Commission meeting in SunTrust Park and the battery at SunTrust, which includes the restaurants, the retail shops, and the hotel at SunTrust Park, almost broke even during the inaugural season of the new home of the Braves. Now, Cobb County Commissioner Bob Ott outlined the numbers at the, at the new budget report this afternoon. He says the park came in just under $30,000 short of breaking even. He says that's really good. It says that's significant considering only 30% of the battery was occupied on opening day and that number was only up to 50% by the end of the season. He told me sales tax revenue will continue to go up as more businesses open up the battery next season. The estimated sales tax revenue projected before this park opened was about 1.7 million. The actual figures 1.6 million. Basically, we came within $27,000 of breaking even. How's that for simple? How did you do it? Well, it's a combination of the success of the ballpark and, the, and what's in the battery. It's also um, the fact that the county managed the expenses as we went into the year. I'm growing increasingly confident that all the revenue projections uh, are going to be met and exceeded uh, based on what I've seen over the last year and what I've seen in the future. That was Chairman Mike Boyce, who, when he was running for that position, was very critical of the park and projections about revenue coming up tonight at 6. You'll hear more about why he says he's now confident that the park is going to thrive and be a big benefit to the county. Reporting live at the Marietta Square in Cobb County, Portia Bruner, Fox 5 News. All right, Portia, thanks. Let's